thinking there's flamingos all over Aruba, but I'm here to tell you there's not. We're going to the Renaissance Hotel right now. They actually own the private island where the flamingos are. And if you have watched any video 2019 or earlier, the rules have changed. So this is the only video you're going to need to watch as of 2020 until the rules change again one day about what you need to do to see those flamingos. Okay guys, we just got our day passes. Right now they have a local special going on, which obviously won't be the case when any of you come. Typically the day passes are $125 a day, and you do have to pre-purchase them on a website. I will link it here. You no longer have to wake up and come to the hotel early in the morning. I typically like to recommend people to just spend a night at the Renaissance Hotel. That way you get the accommodation and you get to go to the island as much as you want the day you check in and the day you check out. But for people that already have accommodations elsewhere, you can get the day pass and you will get lunch and an alcoholic beverage included in your day pass. This is the marina side of the hotel. These are some of the hotel rooms. And then there's another side that's on the ocean, which we'll show you in a little bit. Oh my God, such a good shot. He's right there. It's the ocean side. See the ocean? Right now we're walking down to the boat that we board to go over to the private island. About to board the boat to head over to the private island, which is that away.
little path. This brings you to like a remote side of the island. Two things you need to know. Bring bug spray, there's mosquitoes. I say wear shoes, Mike says no. Renaissance Private Island, aka Flamingo Beach. We're catching our boat back to the hotel. Like and subscribe. See you next time. Bye.